2004 the power of chaos was unleashed Yu-Gi-Oh! Power of Chaos, Yu-Gi-Oh! The Destiny is the first Yu-Gi-Oh! game for PC made in 2004. It is the first of the three Power of Chaos games. The game includes 155 cards. In Yu-Gi-Oh! Power of Chaos, Yu-Gi-Oh! The Destiny, you can learn the basics of summoning, tributes and more in tutorial and then you can duel against Yu-Gi to collect cards and build up your own collection. Every deck has a chance to win, as long as you believe in the heart of the cards. Let's duel! Yu-Gi-Oh! Power of Chaos Skybot Revenge is the second Yu-Gi-Oh! game for PC, also is the second one of the three Power of Chaos game series. The game includes 466 cards. Skybot Revenge works in conjunction with the previous Power of Chaos Yu-Gi-Oh! The Destiny for the PC or as a standalone game. In the new game, collect more than 300 additional cards and create more strategic combos and chains. <laughs> a pathetic dog like you never had a chance against a champion like me. Yu-Gi-Oh! Power of Chaos Joy the Passion is the third Yu-Gi-Oh! game for PC. Also, it's the third and the last one of the three Power of Chaos game series. The game includes 771 cards. This game is featuring Joy Villa as the opponent, adds new cards, new dueling choices, new dueling options and more decks for the opponent making this the Power of Chaos game with the most content. The cards from the previous two Power of Chaos games if installed are included. New game features include a ranked difficulty for the computer opponent denoted by a star gouge in the duel menu which ranks from 1 star to 9. As you win duels, the difficulty increases and the opponent swaps his deck for a more potent one every time this happens. Later difficulty levels, 8 and 9, allow the opponent to use different decks in the same level. Losing consecutive duels results in decreased difficulty for the first time in Power of Chaos games. Other options include allowing the opponent to use cards from the previous two games increasing the difficulty. Also the option to make limited cards for bidden is given making the game more balanced. One other new addition to the game is that when you win cards that you already have you may have a choice of getting different cards or keep the ones you earned. Last you can also duel a friend via local area network. Listen up! A true duelist doesn't back off from nobody cause only cowards don't stand up to a challenge. You better come strong cause it's time to duel! Thanks to the multiplayer enjoy, the game lived for long and still being played today. However, the game today is overhacked and a lot of people stopped playing it. While most of the players moved to play the newest free Yu-Gi-Oh game, Yu-Gi-Oh Pro, which has over 5000 cards, old school Yu-Gi-Oh players quit, well not everyone likes all the new cards. Including myself. But... The time has come... To feel... The power of chaos once more. For old school players, we have downgraded Yu Gi Oh! Pro all the way back to Power of Chaos cards. Now you might wonder. Why to use this version? Less than 200 megabytes. The four important cards. Return back to action. Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro can save replays even if duel aborted or surrendered, so broken duels can be judged more accurately. Tag duels. Players can play 2 vs 2 at same time. Some players can host without Hamachi using direct IP. Official and custom card list and no longer limited to the old inbuilt Power of Chaos room. Faster deck construction. 
More game options. Players can replace background pictures, sounds and music for their liking. And much more. So come and once again embrace the power of chaos! Victory is not in the